In this video, I'm going to be reviewing Gamma.ai. If you have any questions, go ahead and drop them below. I tend to reply within a few minutes to a couple of hours, and I'll also leave a discounted link in the description below. Now, if you don't know what Gamma is, Gamma is kind of like a done for you presentation, document, and web page creator that uses AI to do it for you. So you would enter a topic or some text, and then the AI will just do all of the design itself. So before we jump into that, let's go ahead and explore the dashboard. On the left, we have our navigation. You can, on your keyboard, just press Ctrl and K, and you can jump to different navigation and files in your folder. You can also just click here and it will do the same. You can create folders, so for different clients. And then we have the templates. These are all of the different designs that you can select from. Inspiration, so these are things that Gamma has created for different niches. Themes, so branding colors and stuff like that. And of course, you can create your own theme colors as well. And then you can also do custom fonts. You can also invite people to Gamma to share different projects you've got going on. In the main dashboard area, you then have the create new button, which uses AI. You can then create documents from blank and even import documents from all of these different options. In today's video, we're just going to be focusing on the create new AI feature because that's the one that most people are interested in. We'll go ahead and click create new and we can decide if we want to paste in from notes or import them from slides and documents or if we just want AI to do everything for us. We'll do AI. Let's go ahead and click the presentation option and now a little chat bar opens up and now we give it a topic. This is multilingual so you can actually type it in any language you want. So we're going to say why business owners should be using no code solutions. And then we do enter. Almost instantly, it creates a presentation outline and then do continue. On the right, we can select different design options. I'll go ahead and select this one and then do continue. And right in front of us, it's actually writing all of the text. This is literally using AI right now, finding all the images, all the subheadings and all the text. And just like that, we now have a presentation. So let's just have a quick look. Why business owners should be using no code solutions. Even put in our name. It found an image of a business owner, which is incredible. Then the introduction it's used a complementary background. No code solutions are revolutionizing the way business owners create softwares. Amazing benefits of no code solutions. It's even added little icons, cost savings and time efficiency. This is why people use no code. Empowering non-technical business owners. Again, increasing collaboration and productivity. That's pretty impressive, especially at how nice this is designed. So now that we're in this area, we can do a few things. So if we hover to the left, we can drag these options and place these slides in different orders. We can also copy individual links for the slide. On the right, we can edit with AI. We can use card templates, text formatting, call out blocks, layout options, etc., etc. We can even add in forms like, let's say, type form and just drag it in. And then we can connect our type form here and generate images and do all sorts embed videos. This is seriously impressive. We'll just go ahead and delete that. You can also share the link with others, invite others, share publicly, export it into a PDF or PowerPoint, and then embed it in a website. If you want to present it, click the present button and then use it just like normal PowerPoint. To exit, press escape and boom. Then you've also got the analytic side of things. So this is how many people have engaged with the page and clicked on things and where they've spent most of their time on which slides and everything. All really important information for any business owner. You can also leave comments right here so people can see them. Then once you've created it, it will be left in your dashboard right here, ready for you to do whatever you want with it. This time we'll go ahead and create a web page, and this time we'll do a UX design case study. It's created the outline and we'll do continue. We'll choose a theme, I'll do the vortex theme, and then do continue. And now it's creating a web page for me right in front of our eyes. This is seriously impressive. And just like that, it's done everything for us. So if we just click share, share publicly, public access, and then copy the public link, do done. And now we'll open this up and this is the public link. It's got the contents menu right there, so it's in, it's interactive. It is a little bit like a presentation web page, very static, 
but it looks really good. And just to get something up and going for small business owners, this could be a really handy tool. I don't know how it would rank with SEO, but if we have a look at the source code, it actually looks pretty lightweight. And finally, let's go ahead and do create new. And this time we'll do document. We'll do introduction to woodworking. We've got the outline and do continue. We'll go for a light theme this time. Let's try this one Then do continue. And now it's creating a document for us. In the right hand side, these are all the same options that you use across all the other formats that we try. And there's our document that looks really good as well. And if you don't like something, you can hover over the text or even do add card with AI and suggest more images. So some more images you can go with this. Let's go with this one. And you're actually telling it in plain English to add a new card, etc., which is insane. You can just click on everything and edit if you wanted to. And that's Gamma in a nutshell. Overall, I am seriously impressed with Gamma. The designs are really nice, unique, and fairly modern. The text that's been generated is accurate and formatted really well. The interface is easy to use and it all just works and ties in really nicely. It's got a massive amounts of flexibility without making it too difficult to use. And it's extremely intuitive. So anyone can jump in and within 20 minutes, figure it out and have things up and running. Very useful. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.